Good evening, and welcome to the ASD News. Our top stories tonight, we are joined by President Barack Obama's agent to discuss the latest in politics. Oh, it's very nice to meet you. Oh, pleasure is over. Nice to meet you, sir. Well, it's on Carmine. It's a bit of an informal question, but you won. How does it feel? Well, I mean, it feels really good. All the effort, all the campaigning, all the, all the hard work we have put into this campaign is very nice feeling that we can say we've won this and that we've achieved what we set out to do. It's very nice feeling. You know Obama very well. Yeah. Throughout his campaign, did he think he was going to win? Well, I mean, he he's a fair man. He's not he's not some sort of arrogant man that would just think that yeah, it's in the bag and I've won it. I mean, he's he always thought, well, I mean, there's a chance I can win this and I'm going to stick to it. And at no point did he ever think, yeah, it's in the bag. He always thought, let's just take every day as it comes, try and get as many votes as we can, and if we win in the end, then we've won. That's, that's basically what we did. Have you personally spoken to Obama about his further plans for the United States? Well, we don't really talk about it. It's nothing we don't talk about. We don't really like to discuss it on chat shows, but I mean, I guess it will... I mean, as we all know, he would like to, really wants to crack down on this economy crisis, and that will be his main priority when he comes into presidency. And he will do his very best and put many, many hours into trying to sort out this economy crisis because we can't. It's the it's the building blocks. We can't we can't just start worrying about other things. This is the main crisis at the moment that we need to get sorted, and it will be his main. Yes, yeah, um, on the conference that he did the other day. He was saying that he's going to tackle this head on as soon as he hits presidency. Yeah. Join us after the break. We'll have more. said that one of his um, second plans after the economy is moving troops out of Iraq. I mean, what, what's your view on this? Is he going to do it? Yes, he, is, he plans. That is also one of his things he would like to do. But, I mean, obviously after the economy crisis, because that is a crisis. Um, but yeah, he, he does want to take troops out of Iraq. There is no need for them to be in there. We've got what we need. We, we wanted to get rid of Saddam Hussein. He was a terror to people and he was killing innocent lives and we have achieved that and there is no need for these people to be in Iraq anymore. So we are going to get those troops out and save many more lives. Okay. When Obama was a boy, did he ever think he could become president? Well, I mean, ever, ever since he was a young boy, he, he achieved head boy and he always had ambition and he always wanted to achieve those things. So, I mean, I'm not really surprised that he got there because he had the determination, he wanted to do that much, and that's where he got to. He's put in a lot of effort, and that's, that's, that's what effort gets you. I mean, it's all credit to him. Thank you for coming. It's been lovely to have you on the show. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good to see you soon. <coughs> that's about all we've got time for now. See you next time on ASD News.
the pleasure is all mine. Excuse me, sir. Hello, John Carmine. Well, a bit of an informal question, but you won. How does it feel? Well, I mean, it feels really good because all the work, all the effort we've put into campaigning for this thing. <laughs> <laughs> so you've got to look at me, please. Look at me, yeah?